Hi, it's Kelly here, and in this video, we're going to talk about narcissism in a way that you've never heard before and tell you how to, how to actually get rid of it. It's fantastic. It's not that you have narcissism, but people that you know have it. It's becoming more and more common. By the way, the screen might go fritzy fritzy. If it does, don't worry about it, because this is all going to be, uh, the oral will be just as good as, as the visual, except that I do want to show you this book. Is there a question that heals instantly? Is there a question that heals instantly? We're going to use that question in this video right now at, at, to, to show you how it works. There's a whole lot more in the book, so you'll definitely want to get your hands on it. Um, also, let me say this first. The, the, do not get the book to, to give to someone who's a narcissist and say, hey, this is, this is for your narcissism or, or for the issues that you have the problems that you have because a narcissist will not only get ticked off at you unbelievably they will not read the book and it, it will defeat the entire purpose of it um, what you need to do is get the book for yourself you'll find out how well it works and you will tell them how much you enjoy the book and you recommend it for everybody it's so fantastic and so easy it'll just make their life smoother We'll, and, and just tell them for all the people in their lives that, you know, that give them problems. You know, at, at, you know, on that level, where it's the other, people, the other person's uh, fault. All right? So you, you want to get the book, not them. And, uh, and, and let them get the book. And uh, if you, I don't even know if it'll work if you give them the book just to say, I love this book so much. I wanted everybody to have a copy, so I'm giving it out to everybody. That, maybe that would work. So if you want to get several copies after you order the first copy, you're certainly welcome to do that. So here's the question that works so well. And there's so much more in this book, so I'm not concerned about giving you the question because it's going to tell you how to take it 10 to the 39th power and beyond. And I mean that literally, that number. Um, that's a thousand trillion 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 times stronger by reading the book you'll have a deeper understanding and then you'll go 10 times beyond that and beyond so here's the question why do i love discovering what's between me and loving kindness and then the second time when i ask it i focus on the word love why do i love discovering what's between me and loving kindness so this question works with our brain as our brain is hardwired to look for the answers when we ask ourselves questions and this particular question is looking for ways for us to get to loving kindness you see how that works it has nothing to do with their issues and by the way the issues for a narcissist are deeply deeply embedded oftentimes it's because one of their parents was a narcissist and beat them down so bad that their reaction was to protect themselves by also becoming a narcissist. It's really strong. It's a very strong protective uh, coping mechanism. And that's why you can't get people who have it to talk them, you can't talk to them, talk them out of it. It just, it doesn't work. However, when they ask the question, everybody has problems, whether it's, you know, spilling milk or or whatever you know the alarm clock went off five minutes before you wanted it to you know spats between spouses tra traffic everything we all have them so when those moments come up that cause us to have, have emotional imbalance we say to ourselves why we ask ourselves why do i love discovering what's between me and loving kindness and you only have to ask it twice because the first time you want to focus on discovering because that's where it puts you in neutral it's like doing a google search in your brain and then the second time you're focusing on loving and loving is a gratitude word gratitude brings you grace so now you're in the land of miracles and blessings and it goes beyond that it says here on the book featuring a zero calorie egg and you'll get to find out what the zero calorie egg is it's phenomenal so you you get this book and you and you start using it you don't have to say it over and over again it's not like an affirmation statement it's a question 
and it puts your brain in a search mode, and you'll find that it relieves great traumas in your life, even though you're not you're focusing on on your child, you know, disrespecting you or or, or whatever, um, or you're focusing any minor minor thing, you're focusing on fixing that because our reaction to these minor things are usually identical to the big major traumas in our life. So when we heal that reaction to the small things, the others get lighter and lighter and lighter, and we never have to think about them. Because we've all, you know, any adult can say this pretty safely has had major traumas, right? Sooner or later, something that we have taken on as being traumatic, right? And most of us had multiple tr major traumas. And, and, and we might have a combination of reactions to the different, you know, major traumas, all blended into one big soupy mess. But this question starts to peel that away. It just goes away. And then those major traumas, at some point, they just become like, oh, yeah, yeah, that happened. Man, you know, big deal. And then it goes further, and you look at it, and you feel a blessing from it. You really do. If you get the get the paperback edition because on the back it's going to tell you how it helped me to overcome having a smashed spine at the age of one. It's it's amazing. <laughs> so, <laughs> so thank you for listening. In a later video, I'm going to make later on. I'm going to talk about more about electroculture in a way that you haven't heard before. Electroculture 2.0. Uh, so, so subscribe to my videos, like my videos. It lets YouTube show it to more people, and we can get rid of narcissism all across the planet. And we can we can grow beautiful, beautiful gardens and farms, not have food shortages. So much, so much. This, miracles are endless, and they are beyond what we can imagine. They are 10 to the 40th greater than we can imagine. Well, thank you for listening. You take care, and God bless.